calendar for the 2021 FIA Formula 1 World Championship has been revealed, with the calendar being expanded from 21 races to 23. The 2020 Formula 1 season was meant to have 21 races, but the pandemic meant things had to change and a number of European replacement races were drafted in to replace the Australian and the America's leg of the calendar, leaving 17 races in just 5 months. The 2021 season will hopefully begin on March 21st in Melbourne, Australia, which retains the honour of being the opening race of the season if you compare it to the original 2020 calendar. The 2020 event was very close to taking place with teams already at the racetrack before a positive COVID-19 test within the McLaren team led to the event being cancelled, much to the disappointment of the thousands of fans that gathered at the gates. Secure Bahrain remains the second race in the calendar if you compare it to the original 2021, with the two races at the end of the 2020 season being replaced by just a single race this time round. This event is scheduled to take place on March 20th. The Chinese Grand Prix will take place on April 11th, with the 2020 event being one of the first to be postponed due to the pandemic. It was then ultimately left off the revised 2020 calendar. The Vietnam Grand Prix has been left off the 2021 calendar and BBC Sport are reporting that this is due to corruption charges brought against an organiser of the event. This event has never actually been held before, with 2020 meant to be the inaugural race. There is talks of this first race being held in 2022, but for now the people of Vietnam must wait for a home race. As there is no race on April 25th, Formula 1 are hoping to add an extra race to fill that gap. It is reported by BBC Sport that one of the replacement races from the 2020 season will be added to that calendar, with Turkey, Imola and Portimao the current frontrunners. The Spanish Grand Prix in Barcelona will follow either the Chinese Grand Prix or Grand Prix at one of the 2020 substitute tracks on May 9th. This race also returns to its usual time slot after being held in August during the 2020 season. The historic Monaco Grand Prix returns to the Formula 1 calendar on May 23rd after not running during the 2020 season. This will also round off a busy period for the Principality with the historic Grand Prix, the Formula E Monaco E Prix and the Formula 1 Monaco Grand Prix all taking place within a month. The F1 circus then goes from one street circuit to another and to the Azerbaijan Grand Prix on June 6th. This is another circuit that was dropped from the revised 2020 calendar, but the race around the streets of Baku is back for another year after becoming a permanent fixture on the F1 calendar in 2017. The race had been held in the calendar the year before, running under the European Grand Prix name. Formula 1 then heads over to Canada and to Montreal on June 13th, with the race returned to the calendar as they're also being dropped from the revised 2020 calendar. Another race that didn't feature on the 2020 calendar was the French Grand Prix, which returns on June 27th. The revised 2020 season opener in Austria returns to its usual July time slot, with a race around Spielberg taking place on July 4th. There will only be one race at the Red Bull Ring this time around, after hosting two at the start of the 2020 season. After having a double header for races 3 and 4 of the 2020 season at Silverstone, the British Grand Prix would take place on July 18th, a week after the finals of Wilmington and the final of the Euro 2020 at Wembley Stadium in London. The Belgian Grand Prix is another race that survived the 2020 season, with August 29th playing host to the Grand Prix around spa francorchamps Zandvoort then makes its second attempt at an F1 revival on September 5th, with the event in 2020 being cancelled due to the organisers wanting fans present for the return of the event. The Italian Grand Prix in Monza is a week later in the 2021 season on September 12th with the 2020 edition surviving on the revised calendar. It might be the only race in Italy during the 2021 season despite having three races in the country during 2020. The Russian Grand Prix in Sochi also retains its place in the calendar with the race being around a similar date as the 2020 edition a day earlier on September 26th. Marina Bay in Singapore returns to the calendar after a year's absence in 2020, with the Grand Prix taking place on October 3rd. Formula 1 returns to Japan this season after being another victim of the revised 2020 calendar. 
The 2021 event will take place on October the 10th. The United States Grand Prix also makes a return to the calendar, with the race in Austin, Texas being held on October 23rd. That race kicks off the America's leg of the calendar, which returns in 2021, with the Mexican Grand Prix taking place on October 31st. The Brazilian Grand Prix returns on November 14th, but more importantly, it will take place in Interlagos, and not the new potential circuit in Sao Paulo that's being looked at. This race is still requiring promoter agreement, however. November 28th sees the penultimate race of the season, and the new addition to the Formula 1 calendar. The Saudi Arabian Grand Prix will take place for the first time, but has already come under fire for ethical and cultural issues within the country. The 2021 Formula 1 season will conclude with the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix on December 5th. The final race under the current technical regulations potentially brings to an end the era of dominance for Mercedes and the careers of some of the most talented drivers that we have ever seen. So that's going to bring to an end of today's video. Let us know in the comment section below what you make of the new 2021 Formula 1 calendar and which race you're most excited for. If you want to keep up to date with all things motorsport, then why not check out our website, theapexmotorsport.com and also follow us on social media so you don't miss out on any content here on the Apex Motorsport. Thank you all so much for watching and hope to see you in the next one. Goodbye.